Let's talk about synths for a minute. That's not about sins, <laughs> but synth is short for synthesizer, an electronic device that creates sound. A digital synth creates sound on a digital computer, like this one I'm using right now, by calculation. And most synthesizers today are actually computers. SonicPy and SonicPy uses the play command to trigger a synth. That's what we do here. If we hit run, our program is executed, the first and only line is executed, and boom, this command triggers this, the synth to play and uh, uses the parameter of 60. It takes a note as a parameter, as we have already heard in the last video, expressed as a numer numeric value, here 60, a MIDI note, 60 is a C4, a C on the fourth MIDI octave. So there's a symbolic way of writing it, if you don't want the numbers, that would be a C4, and basically it should sound the same, it does, and a C5 would be one octave higher, and a C3 lower. All the same tone on different octaves. So, uh, I prefer the numbers. I'm a number guy. Okay. Well, the numbers are actually, for me, much easier to understand than the black eggs painted on lines with hashtags in front of them. But, uh, well, not everybody, not everybody is like me, of course. Uh, so this is why there are the two versions, like the MIDI numbers and the symbolic representation with the uh, colon symbol. Well, synthesizers aren't those these fancy keyboard machines on stage? Well, I said already that today many synthesizers are actually computers. So the keyboard that you actually see is not the main piece of it. Uh, it's a computer which is built inside that thing and they are actually mostly programmable computers with good sound chips. But we can do a lot with a PC today as well as you can hear. Uh, there's another aspect, aren't there many different synths? So that can sound different. And which one is actually used if we use Play 60 this way? Well, in Sonic Pi, like in many other computer situations, if you omit some specification, a default is used. The default synth in Sonic Pi is sine. Sine a harmonic sine wave. This is what you hear if I press run right now. Sonic Pi has many built-in synths and the number is growing. I've even built some myself, as I said in the last video. Let's try some. And uh, we do it this way. We go and introduce an additional line before, use synths, and let's start out with pulse. Sounds quite different. We actually get different harmonic uh, up here on our oscilloscope. As you've seen before, if I use the sine wave, I get just one particular uh, frequency. frequency higher in this case, lower in this case, but let's try other synths. So a saw wave, or a triangle wave, oops, sound like this, okay, or 
one of the mythical stints of the 80s, Acid House, the TB303, or maybe something like Bass Foundation. Well, we can go a little bit lower with this one. Okay. Or Hoover. Let's see how this far sounds. Oh, Hoover. Oh, Hoover. And with the 60. Very full sound. Okay, so uh, these are different synths that we can choose with the use synths command uh, starting from this line on in the context that we are currently in instead of the default synth sign the synth indicated in this line is used. By the way did you notice our program has grown? We now have one, two lines, one command or statement each. Use synths, plays, uh, play. One executed after the other. So first is this line, then comes this line. This is the simplest and most common control structure element, the sequence. First one, then the next. So, something about programming that we have already learned. Again, use synth is a command that takes an argument. If I omit it, I get an error. And you can see the error message below here. Runtime error wrong number of arguments. Very typical computer situation as well. Computers need certain specifications. They, we, they need us to fulfill certain rules and if we don't then hopefully they throw errors because if they uh, continue executing then uh, very strange things may happen. So we put that back here with a high end bass. Wow. Okay, and that's that in this little video.